Advanced manufacturing is something that EPRI has identified as a vital part of deploying new nuclear at scale around the world. Directed energy deposition, or DED, is one such technique. DED starts with a deposition head, a nozzle that feeds a wire heated by an electric arc and protected by shielding gas. The arc creates a melt pool on the base material, which joins the melting wire to form a layer of deposited material. This robotic head then works in layers, similar to 3D extrusion printers, until it builds up to the component. This fabricated component isn't quite finished though. The buildup of layers causes texture, which requires machining for some surfaces to result in the final product. DED is a great tool in the toolbox because it can be used to create complex components quickly, reducing costs for advanced reactors. Some operating plants have parts that are at the end of their service life, so being able to scan a component and rapidly fabricate a replacement lets this technique serve the operating fleet. There's even flexibility to DED because wire isn't the only available feedstock. Powder can be used just as easily, with each having different benefits. Right now, EPRI is performing the testing necessary to add this technology as an acceptable method for fabrication in nuclear and ASME Section 3 applications. Increasing the use of techniques like DED in industry will support the deployment of nuclear to meet decarbonization goals. And through initiatives like AM3, EPRI is paving the way.